no hop is a POSIX command to ignore the HUP signal. The HUP signal is, by convention, the way a terminal warns dependent processes of logout. Output that would normally go to the terminal goes to a file called no hop out if it has not already been redirected. Use, the first of the commands below starts the program ABCD in the background in such a way that the subsequent logout does not stop it. Dollar no hop ABCD and dollar exit. Note that these methods prevent the process from being sent a stop signal on logout, but if input outputs is being received for these standard I.O. files, they will still hang the terminal. See overcoming hanging, below. No hop is often used in combination with the nice command to run processes on a lower priority. Dollar no hop nice ABCD and existing jobs, processes, some shells provide a shell built-in that may be used to prevent SIG up being sent or propagate to existing jobs, even if they were not started with no hop. In bash, this can be obtained by using disown H job. Using the same built-in without arguments removes the job from the job table, which also implies that the job will not receive the signal. Before using disown on an active job, it should be stopped by CTRLZ, and continued in the background by the BG command. Another relevant bash option is shopped hup and exit, which automatically sends the HUP signal to jobs when the shell is exiting normally. The AIX and Solaris versions of NoHop have AP option that modifies a running process to ignore future SIG up signals. Unlike the above described disown built in of bash, NoHop E accepts process IDs. Overcoming hanging, note that no hopping backgrounded jobs is typically used to avoid terminating them when logging off from a remote SSH session. A different issue that often arises in this situation is that SSH is refusing to log off, since it refuses to lose any data from to the background job, S. This problem can also be overcome by redirecting all three I.O. streams. Dollar no hop. Slash my program foo out to, foo no land. Also note that a closing SSH session does not always send a HUP signal to depending processes. Among others, this depends on whether a pseudo terminal was allocated or not. Alternatives, the screen or mu command can also detach a process from the current shell. It allows one to reattach to the process later on, for example the following call will run sawmiscript detached from sig up and in the background. The disown command is used to remove jobs from the job table, or to mark jobs so that a SIG up signal is not sent. References External links No help from Solaris's man pages.